Welcome to the Real Estate Way to Wealth and Freedom podcast with Jacob Ayers, providing actionable content to help you along your journey to financial freedom through real estate investing. As the premier asset class, real estate has helped ordinary people just like you amass fortunes. The benefits of passive income from real estate investing will allow you to live a life you want. And now your host, entrepreneur, real estate investor, and apartment deal syndicator, Jacob Ayers. Hi, and welcome to the Real Estate Way to Wealth and Freedom podcast, episode 173. Hi, I'm your host, Jacob Ayers, and you are listening to Friday Fundamentals. Hey, thanks so much for tuning in to yet another episode of I'm so excited because this is the first Friday of the new year and Fridays are my empire days, I call them. So I'm so excited you're tuning along today. Well, hey, I would like to hear about your New Year's resolutions, your 2019 goals. So reach out to me, tag me on social media, whatever you'd like. I want to know what you're up to and how I can help you. Well, let's jump into this week's Friday Fundamental. This week's Friday Fundamental is B personable. Real estate investing is a dollars and numbers driven game from cap rates and internal rates of return to lead generation response rates and occupancy rates. With all that, it can be easy to get lost in all of the numbers looking at each and every opportunity through a spreadsheet. Now, sure, the numbers are important. After all, that's why you were investing in real estate in the first place. But it's important to remember that behind every number, behind every deal, behind every loan, insurance policy, management company, mailing list, and contract is a person. Now, some would say real estate is a numbers game as they measure and focus on ROI, cash on cash returns, cap rates, interest rates, etc. Others will tell you it's an operations game as they focus on property management, leasing, implementing value-add business plans, and exit strategies. Then there are the people who say that real estate is a relationship game as they focus on building relationships with brokers, investors, property managers, property owners, etc. No matter what game you are playing, it's important to remember that you are dealing with people. People who want to be treated like people, not numbers on a spreadsheet. The best way to connect with someone is to just be personable. Being personable means you are able to relate to others and be relatable. By understanding that each person has their own agenda, challenges, and goals, you can relate to that person and understand their perspective. This is especially vital when negotiating. Now, building a personal relationship with each and every person you come across will pay dividends. Here are five ways you can be more personable. One Find a common topic that you both can relate to. That might be the holidays, the weather, sports teams, news, etc. If you can find common ground, you can relate to that person and start to build some report. Now, you don't have to go to great lengths here and give your bio every time you meet somebody, but If you can just share a small personal detail about yourself, it will show that you too are human with challenges and goals just like that other person. Three, ask questions about the other person. Get to know them on a personal level. This might be the easiest way to connect with someone. Simply ask a question about the person and listen. Talking about yourself is easy for most people, and it's natural to want to do so. So run with that and let the other person do the majority of the talking. 
Four, ask the person for a small favor. This one sounds weird, I know, but it comes from a psychological trick I read about in Robert Cialdini's book, Influence, The Psychology of Persuasion. If you ask someone for a favor, they are inclined to say yes. Their rationalization kicks in and they come up with reasons why you are worthy of such a favor. Now, be sure to return that favor in the future and you'll be in good standing with that person. And lastly, be understanding of the other person's position. Put yourself in their shoes and think of their interests before your own. If you can do these five simple things, you'll become a much more personable person and someone each and every person can relate to. Real estate investing, although number and dollar focused, is a relationship business at its core. People before profits should be your mantra. If you want to be a successful real estate investor, you should focus on helping other people. Don't focus so much on what you want, rather on the other person's interests. If you can do these things, you become a relatable, likable person that everybody enjoys working with and helping out, thus benefiting yourself in the long run for the long game. That's one of the things I'm trying to do here on this show is help you and be a relatable person and show you my strengths and weaknesses, my challenges, my daily struggles, etc. So I really hope that you're feeling a connection with me personally. I would love to further build that connection and relationship with you. So reach out to me on social media or the website or wherever you would like and just say hi, bounce some questions off of me, tell me what you're up to. And of course, like I mentioned at the beginning of the show, Tell me what you're up to in 2019 and what goals you have in mind. So, well, that wraps up this week's episode of Friday Fundamentals. Hey, I hope you're really getting value from these podcasts. If you like what you've heard, please go over and leave a rating and review on whichever platform you're listening on. For more information, resources, and to connect with me, you can do so at www.jacobayers.com. Dot com. Till next week, engineer the lifestyle you want. You've been listening to the Real Estate Way to Wealth and Freedom podcast, providing you actionable content to build your real estate empire. Nothing on this show should be considered specific, personal, or professional advice. Please consult an appropriate tax, legal, real estate, financial, or business professional for personal advice. The opinions of guests are their own information is not guaranteed. All investment strategies have a potential for profit or loss. The host is operating on behalf of the Real Estate Way to Wealth and Freedom LLC exclusively.